In this video, we will convert the following numbers to percentage. Then, 6 to 10, we will solve this. And then, dito tayo sa pang civil service exam. What percent of one half is 50? Convert the following numbers to percentage. The easiest way to do this ay i-move lang natin yung decimal to the right twice at lagyan ng percent sign. So, nandito na yung decimal. So, this is equals to 25% or 0.25 times 100% and that is equals to 25% percent percent next again i-move natin itong decimal na to to the right twice one two so nandito na yung decimal at lagyan ng percent sign ang space lagyan ng zero so this is equals to 50 percent otherwise it can be done like this point five times one hundred percent that is equals to 50 percent I keep yung percent sign next one itong one na to nandito yung decimal niya i move natin twice to the right at nandito na yung decimal lagyan ng percent sign at yung space lagyan ng zero so one is equals to 100 percent Otherwise, pwedeng ganito, 1 times 100% and that is equals to 100%. Keep natin yung percent sign kasi nga, we are converting the following numbers to percentage. Next, itong 10. Ang 10, ang decimal niya ay nandito. Again, to convert this to percentage, i-move lang natin ang decimal to the right twice at nandito na yung decimal niya. Ang space ay lagyan natin ng zero tapos yung percent sign. So, therefore, itong 10 na to is equals to 1,000 percent. At pwede ring 10 times 100 percent and that is equals to 1,000 percent. Again, i-keep natin dito yung percent sign kasi nga we are converting the following numbers to percentage number five 100 nandito yung decimal ni 100 i move natin twice to the right nandito na yung decimal at lagyan ng percent sign yung space lagyan natin ng zero so 100 is equals to 10,000 percent otherwise pwede rin ganito 100 times 100 percent is equals to 10,000 percent. Kinikip natin yung percent sign kasi nga, we are converting these numbers to percentage. Next, dito na tayo sa number 6. So, the following is solve natin. So, 0.25 times 50 percent or half ng 0.25. Ang half niyan ay 0.125. Isa-isahin natin. 0.25 times 50% i-convert natin into decimal and that is 0.5. So, 0.25 times 0.5, isa-isahin natin i-multiply. Meron na tayong separate video kung paano mag-multiply ng mga decimal numbers. So, this is 25. 2 times 5 equals 10, plus 2 is equals 12. Ang decimal, 1, 2, 3. Kaya from here, 1, 2, 3. So, nandito yung decimal. So, this is equals to 0 0.125. Itong number 7, 8, 9, 10, 100% lang naman yan. Kung i-convert mo yan, yung 100%, that is 1. So, any number you multiply natin sa 100% is equals to the same number. So this is 0 0.25, 1, 10, 100. Unless na lang 
we convert natin into percent itong mga numbers na ito. Kaso lang, we, what we will do here is, is solve lang natin siya. So, i-multiply natin siya to 100%, which is ang 100% percent equals to 1. So, minumultiply lang natin siya by 1. Kaya, ito lang din yung mga sagot dyan. Kung nalilito kayo dito banda, you need to watch this again. I-review nyo yung set A natin. Now, let's do set itong pang civil service exam style. What percent of one half is 50? Let, uh, so rewrite muna natin. What percent of one half is 50? Let N be that percent na later on, i-multiply natin ng 100% or convert natin into percentage kasi nga ang hinahanap naman ay what percent. So let N be that number. Ang of, multiplication yan siya. One half, kopyahin lang yan. Ang is, equals siya. Ang 50, kopyahin lang siya. Ito na yung equation sa problem na ito. Now, pwede na nating isolve. I-isolate natin si n dito. Itong one half, since pang multiply siya or Kung gusto nyo itong 1 half, i-convert natin into decimal and that is equals to 0.5. Now, para ma-isolate natin si n dyan, since si 0.5 ay pang-multiply sa n, pang-divide na ngayon siya sa 50. So, 50 divided by 0.5. Ang the best lang natin gawin ay, i-move itong decimal to the right once para maging whole number si 5. Now, kung nag-move kang ng once dito, mag-move ka rin sa taas once. So, itong space na to lagyan mo ng zero. So, that is 500. Now, 500 over 5 is equals to 100. Ngayon ang tanong, what percent? 100 i-convert natin into percentage. So, mag-move ta ngayon ng dalawang decimal to the right. One, two. Nandito na yung decimal at lagyan mo ng percent sign. Ang space, lagyan mo ng zero. So, this is equals to 10,000 percent. Dapat may percent sign kasi ang 10,000 lang ay hindi yan equal sa 10,000 percent. Another way, 100 times 100 percent that is equals to 10,000 percent. Dapat nandun pa rin yung percent sign kasi nga what percent yung tanong. So therefore, ang tamang sagot dito ay itong letter D. Ipaliwanag lang natin kung bakit mali ang 100 percent. Ang tanong again ay what percent of one half? Okay, wait. If ang 100%, yan yung isagot natin. So, 100% of one half is not 50. Ang 100% of one half is equals to one half or point. Five. Si 1 half or itong 0.5 ay hindi equal sa whole number na 50. So therefore, ang 100% ay mali. Kaya wag magpalito kung ang instruction ay or kung ang hinihingi ay what percent, then ang sagot mo dito ay 100 lang. I-convert mo yan to percentage. At ganito yung pag-convert para magkaroon siya ng percent sign. Thank you. By the way, please see description ng video ito for more examples about percentage.